If anything, the bond between tissue and electrode seems to be getting stronger. So I'm free to go? Well, Mr. Seraph did ask me to discuss another topic with you. You are aware that several precautionary measures had to be put into place during your first surgery? Not all of my implants were switched on, I know. The damage caused by the hematoma had to be taken into account. Your brain needed time to recover, to get used to the mechanical neural processors and turn them on naturally over time. Cut to the chase, Doc. What does Seraph want? He feels that you might be ready to speed up the activation process using special software known as Praxis Kits. You mean I don't have to wait for my augmentations to kick in naturally anymore? You can, if you prefer. But Mr. Seraph did make a generous donation to Lim in your name thus ensuring that Praxis software linked to your particular neuro enhancements would always be available to you and you alone. Please, take a look. Buying stuff. Neat. And we got 500 more credits, which means we got crap loads of money. Let's acquire some items, shall we? Not really Typhoon ammo, because we don't have that yet. What we really need... I wonder what that does, actually, this hypostem. Temper increase up to 50 points. And then we have this, which is 250. That's quite a lot. I mean, this is your basic healing thing, I imagine. Your stim pack, if you will. And this uh, replenishes three energy cells. That's a major, um, like, uh, battery, <laughs> basically. Um, I also like how they've, they've, they've done this. So, like, this is why... You, you have the potential for all of this stuff, but it's not actually installed. Because you could wonder if you're going to be like a, you know, a super soldier sort of character, why they didn't just install all of this stuff on you straight away, you know. Um, and it's because your body would reject it, so they had to do it over time, and now you can start adding stuff um, with these Praxis kits, which we will now buy, both of them. We still have nine grand, but we might as well actually think about it now. Just buy couple of these to add to our sort of health and that and um, I'm not going to buy this yet though because adding three batteries is a bit of a waste when I only have a maximum of two very well Mr. Jensen use it in good health and now this is where it gets real because now we have four Praxis points well, something I really do want is a social enhancer which is worth two and uh, I can analyze people and persuade them. For more info, there's quite a lot of it. Basically, you can uh, know what to say in social situations. I'm going to buy that. That is damn useful. So there we go. That's that. And uh, what else should we get? This is a little more interesting. I'm not quite sure. Because we ha we got that now. We got the radar system. See, now I can 3, 4, and 5. Hacking terminals is good, so I'm going to buy one of those so I can hack another terminal. I can disable robo uh, robots and turrets, possibly, but let's just spread these out a little bit. A little bit. See what we've got here. Smart vision costs 2. Most of them will, actually. Um, what's this? Costs nothing. All right, let's see. No, okay, so that, that shows me when they will uh, return to normal state. That's not really that useful. Uh, protects against the effects of concussion grenades. Could be probably useful. Reflex booster? Nope. Icarus landing system? Nope. Uh, implanted rebreather. That costs two as well. Uh, now, I can have an extra energy cell. I think I'm going to stick with uh, our speeds up energy recharge again. That's not really that useful, I don't think. Could be, if you've got more... Um, hmm. I think I'll leave that. I'm not quite sure, actually, thinking about it, whether... Because this will... Uh, hmm. Because I think, like, once you've used an energy cell, it doesn't replenish. You can only have one replend at any time, and then you've got to do the other sort of manually with, with those bars or those pills or whatever. Um, however it works. So having additional ones just adds to your sort of maximum. But after, as they're used up, you can't get up to three unless you replenish them. 
So I don't think this is particularly useful. Um, at least at this stage, you can aim, stimulize, and that's only S2 as well. What's this one? Um, increases inventory size to two columns, very useful. You can bust through weakened walls with your arms, or I can throw heavier objects. This is probably useful. I don't think I need the increased capacity just yet. So I can throw heavy objects. Hmm. Or I can uh, bash through weakened walls. And that leads on to re well, both of them leads on to real recoil reduction, which actually helps with uh, guns. So it could be a good thing. Do I want to bash through walls, or do I want to be able to move? I mean, they're both contextual, so it's kind of a Mm, I think this one. I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna be able to move heavy objects. There we go. Anything else around here? I don't think so. I'm just getting a minor neuroprosthetic upgrade, but even so, it's stressful. Mm. And you? Did you hear about the protest? If we listened to them, we'd be living in the dark ages. Obviously, everyone in here will pretty much be pro augmentation since they're actually buying them. Protesting is not against the law. I know that, officer. But some of those guys were carrying tire irons and setting garbage cans on fire. And those were the ones we arrested. The rest were merely exercising their right to free speech. What about my right to come to work each day without fearing for my life? I've still got to walk home tonight. I understand your concern. But if you want round-the-clock protection, I suggest you hire a private security company. Hmm. Hmm. People see conspiracies everywhere. They're saying that Lim's personal catalogs mean some people get preferential treatment. Please. Please. I love the sort of the, the moral debates that this game raises, again, with, with the protests and stuff. I mean, that, that stuff goes on every day. Um, nevertheless, you know, protests are a massive inconvenience I finished at the clinic. for people. For now. <laughs> Good. Right now I want to know who Wall that Street, corpse anyone? is. Head over to the police station and get his neural hub. And Adam, if you can't talk your way in, consider making a strategic retreat. There's got to be another entrance in the side of the building. There is a ladder up here. Why the hell not? Apart from the fact that it is a ladder and is therefore evil! That's been destroyed! Oh, a thingy thing. Four, huh? That's no good for me. Ugh. Hmm. Wondering about what order to do things in. Let's have a look at our map and see which is closest. This one is. Detective Chase, he's right there. Right there. Hmm. A person with a gun. Although we did hear about this before. The gas station. Gun supplier. Let's head on in to see if we can uh, speak to someone here. You got anything you want to buy or sell? I'm the guy you want to deal with. Everything's on the computer, right at your fingertips. Well, it's buy for now. I don't know what we really need. Um, probably nothing, currently. Mines. An automated locking device. I can just unlock any door. That's actually pretty useful. I'm going to borrow it. Um, info. Automatic ha hacking device. Ninety-eight percent. I don't know whether that's like actually it has a ninety-eight percent of succeeding, or whether it just accounts for the two percent that you can't. Well, not two percent, but the small um, sort of proportion of um, keypads that the game actually wants you to find the way to unlock it, rather than putting one of these on it. These are useful. I shall buy. Uh, all of them. Screw it. What have I got to sell? He really wants my sniper rifle. It's a lot of money. Hmm. There's not nothing I don't really need. I've been quite careful with that. We'll uh, we'll back up. And exit the shop. See you soon. Oh, I also want to do a little bit of this. There. How do I? Um, okay. 
Sniper rifle on through. Uh, four is actually quite fine for that, actually. I think about it. Well, painkillers. Oh, I've removed it. See, this is okay. I'm probably not going to use this too much anyway because the inventory is like much sort of more convenient. Really shouldn't be, but it can be. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where have they disappeared to? Oh, there. They take up two slots. Well, it's a good thing I sold that, um, well, not sold, but sort of abandoned that, um, machine pistol because I wouldn't be able to buy any of that otherwise. 